Thanks for tuning in tonight at 10. I'm Courtney Wheaton. Right now, local health care workers say they're joining the fight against racism. Tonight, gathering in Springboro for a moment of silence in member of COVID-19 victims and to raise awareness about discrimination. Dayton 24-7 now is Chelsea Sick was there as they protested while remaining socially distant. She has a message from these doctors to protesters here in the Miami Valley. For eight minutes and 46 seconds, about 100 local physicians took a knee in remembrance of George Floyd and COVID-19 victims. Dozens of medical students also in attendance. Especially someone who is in medical school and a future physician to show that I support um, the call for, for change. The Associate Dean for Student Affairs at the Wright State Boonshoff School of Medicine, Dr. Gary Leroy, says it's important for students to be out here as the next generation of doctors. All of these students are out here uh, of all colors, all cultures are out here joining with us to uh, shed the uh, light about what's happening in this country. Miami Valley area physicians of Indian origin organized the moment of silence. They say while they're proud of our community for standing up against injustice, they want to remind them coronavirus is also still in our area. We don't want to roll into another problem by doing protests without maintaining social distancing and wearing masks. We might have a second wave of COVID. Dr. Leroy says right now the pandemic and racial tension in our country run hand in hand. This, as the organizers say, COVID-19 is killing black Americans at nearly two and a half times the rate of white Americans. People of color, we're the most vulnerable of this, of dying from, from COVID-19. We have to recognize that this isn't a choice by those populations to die of these things. Dr. Leroy says this is because of the social situations many black Americans are faced with out of their control. He says protesters should continue wearing masks, staying socially distant, and washing their hands. At the same time, organizers encourage the community to keep fighting for equality. As physicians, we are proud of our community for standing up against um, the prejudice and social injustice, and we are hoping that our voice will be heard. The Miami Valley area physicians of Indian origin say they're a non-political organization, but they believe in peace and equality. To read their full statement about both of those issues, go to Dayton247now.com and click on this story under Top Stories. For now, reporting live in Dayton, Chelsea Sick, Dayton247now News.